We know him as the roving reporter and anchor with CNN. But starting this fall, Anderson Cooper will host his own daytime television talk show. I really like daytime television. You can really kind of go in-depth on stories in a way that you can't uh, on, a, on an evening newscast. The well-known journalist was in Toronto today to promote his new show called Anderson. It will premiere weekday afternoons on the A Network when it becomes CTV2 in September. I, I want it to be entertaining, uh, and, but also informative. And I think that there's, there's a way to do both. And I really want it to be a place that people feel that they can connect, connect with each other, connect with, with themselves, with their communities. Anderson is just one of the new shows you can expect to see this fall. British music executive Simon Cowell will premiere his new show, X Factor. Mike Cosentino is CTV's senior VP of programming. This has guaranteed hit uh, written all over it. So we're going to do something we did with American Idol. We'll put the results show on uh, CTV2 and uh, currently the A schedule. And we'll put the performance show on CTV. Our new CTV2 fall lineup also offers some new comedies. Up All Night is a series about a couple dealing with an unexpected pregnancy. There's Man Up, a show about three guys figuring out masculinity, and Free Agents, starring Hank Azaria. And you'll get to watch all of these new shows and the entire CTV2 lineup in high definition. Work is going on behind the scenes right now to bring on the new technology. I feel that we need to be in HD to be competitive and to really deliver the brand promise of CTV. Crime shows, Criminal Minds, Law and & Order, SVU, and CSI Miami will move from CTV to CTV2. Two and a half men will return, only this time Ashton Kutcher will be replacing Charlie Sheen. And you'll be able to watch the hit show The Big Bang Theory on CTV2 as well as CTV. The show's actors were also in Toronto today, and here's why they think the comedy is so successful. We think the writing is why we think it's a really well written show and uh, we're lucky to have a great chemistry and um, people care about these characters in toronto julia burke a news three mentions in the cartoon so what's it like every day when you walk